Man, I feel like everything that's happening was supposed to happen. What do you mean? Everything's inevitable. This is how people are actually feeling. Yeah, how I feel about it? This is the way about it going? No. But is everyone perfect? No. What I'm trying to say is, everyone feel like that. Everybody feel like that. That's all I got to say. Man, everything lit, man. I love when it's hot, man. You feel me? We will be heard. So I wanted to ask you guys, why do you feel like people are criticizing the building burnings? Because they don't know. They don't, they're privileged. They're not, they feeling they this. don't care about the humans. They don't this care is, about the black folks. This, this is temporary, okay? This is temporary shit. This is our future we stand up for. We making history yeah, right now. Want. Our ancestors lived through us. They lived through us. But we gonna cause a scene. We will be heard. Y'all don't wanna listen. You gonna feel us. And fuck Trump. He trying to shoot us, man. Yeah. You see that? He calls us thugs and we're out here living through hundreds of years of discrimination and a bunch right. of stigma that we face every single day. We tried we tried peaceful protesting, we tried every different direction, and this is our this was our last resort. Fuck the police. Fuck the world. Uh, I don't really have anything to say other than congratulations on your deal with absolutely. Fuck the police. Rest in peace, George Floyd. It's not up to me anymore, but I'm here and I'm trying to protect people. Had shit under control for a little bit. Shit got out of control, station caught on fire. Obviously things caught on fire. Uh, and the National Guard is now here, and they're gassing. Did you get gassed? Yeah, I got gassed pretty good. I got rubber bulleted a few times. Yeah. Damn, did that hurt? Fuck yeah, it hurt, but I, honestly, it wasn't that bad. I'll take a million more. So in your eyes, what is the final uh, message of all these protests? Complete police reform. Four convictions is, is not enough. Four convictions is not justice. Complete police reform, now. How do you feel about this, man? Dude, it's fucking necessary. Shit needs to happen, for sure. It's just gonna keep happening until those other pigs are fucking locked up. It sucks to see our city burning, man, but it's also, they're fucking finally listening to us. Yeah. I'm okay to peaceful protesting. And that how, feel, that, that what, what did that lead to? He still got that assassinated. Feel. They took him at, They took him for granted. Yeah. My nigga, I'm talking yeah, to the guy from All Gas No Rake. This fucking land, hey. <laughs> Fuck those other media outlets because they're gonna try to portray us in a bad light by only showing what's going on over this here. Is the only that way is we are heard. This is the only way we are heard. Hey. Actions speak louder than words, bro. Fuck all that talking. So, uh, what's going on, man? What affiliate do you guys work for? Worth uh, care. Hell yeah. Are you guys allowed to interview people? Uh, yeah. Yeah, we are. Person? Yeah. Sorry, we're about to go on air here, so I gotta... This, this, this how I feel about it. Dude was on handcuffs, and he should have had his, head, his knee on his neck like that, bro. Yeah. You wrong, bro. In your guys' eyes, how long should this go on for? They gotta do something with him if they want this to stop. Manslaughter ain't nothing. Hey, if I have my man in the white man neck with two of my motherfucking niggas holding his legs, Come on now. Fuck the fire, nigga. That nigga need to die, Joe. It doesn't really make sense to me, to be honest. How come you're here? It's just, I don't support the looting and the fires. I'm just supporting the cause. I can't do anything to help it. What, what, what do you mean? I gotta wish I could put this shit out right now, because, like, Target, I don't care about because it's a big corporation, but, like, all these small businesses, it sucks. <laughs> I think we're just causing enough chaos to get attention. You know, we, we want this shit going countrywide. We want the person with no, no sense to their name to have enough word in this world to change it. We're going to do that All one right. way or another. I just think what people are doing here is ruining um, the whole point of this. The media is going to pay attention more to uh, the crime being committed with the looting rather than the anger and the injustice. I'm trying to stop people from doing that. I think there's a right way to protest and that's peacefully. Um, we saw that many times with the Martin, uh, Martin Luther King demonstrations and those marches. They were known for their peace. Um, and I think our generation has something to learn. Fuck that. We tired, homie. We tired of that punk ass shit. What if we gave them back their white sheets?
the racist pigs. What if we gave them back their white sheets? What if they left in white sheets? What if I had my knee and name that for 11 minutes? What do you think would happen? I think shit would change. It should have started with Mookie Mo. It should have started with J. Mark Clark. It should have started with Philando Castile, but we were peaceful. So, so now we're to the point to where we're so fed up that, you know, it, it, it may not ever stop until we get the right convictions of all four. We want all four cops to get the same charge. Man, I appreciate you listening and giving us, a, you know, an outlet and a, and a platform to speak how we feel, bro.